on this day. And Father, we thank you right now. Stand on your Lord of healing and deliverance and miracles in this place. And Father, we thank you right now. Oh, Father, right now we expect the unexpected on this day. And Father, we just ask you to just have your way. Father, we thank you, Lord, for all you're doing and what you're about. So this is our prayer.
times. This morning we're asking you as never before. Yes, God. Send down your power. Yes. Lord, we can't do anything without you. We're helpless yes. without you, Lord. Just breathe on us. Stir us up on the inside.
anniversary of Bishop yeah. Pastor McDowell. Yeah. Amen. Amen. And First Lady McDowell. Amen. We want to leave a little word which encourage. Amen. Our bishop, he said, just bring a little few words of encouragement. Do what you do by the grace of God. Amen. That's, he made me feel real comfortable about coming. Yes, yes, Amen. While we was on the phone. Yes. Amen. When I checked my phone, I was, I was visiting uh, one of my members at that time, taking her something. She needed something. And um, the bishop had texted me while I was in her house, but I didn't take my phone in with me. And as I was getting in my car, I just got in my car and the phone rang. Bishop had already, when I checked my phone late, I saw that he had already called me and take. Bishop didn't give me a chance to call me back. He said, <laughs> <laughs> he said, call me when you get a chance. When I read the text, I said, well, I don't need to call him. We don't talk. <laughs> but I thank God for you, Bishop, uh. counting us worthy to come and stand. Amen today. I thank God for our bishop because when I first came in as a pastor, he was right there encouraging me yes. to God be the glory. Never will be forgotten. Amen. Amen. And how he made me feel. Amen. Praise the Lord when I came in and he said I was getting in my car. Sister, wait a minute. Sister, wait a minute. He came over and encouraged me. I said, from leadership, that feels real good. Amen. That feels real good. Amen. He was the assistant to the bishop at that time. Oh, God, I thank you. Thank you, thank you Bishop, for your leadership. To God be the glory. Yeah, thank you, Mother Madai, for your love, your caring, and your sharing. Amen. Loving on us. We are all, she said, my babies. We are all her babies. Amen. Hallelujah, Amen. glory to God. Jesus. We love you all for that. My heart is overwhelmed thinking about the love y'all have for us. Amen. And we thank God for you. Yes. But the book of Deuteronomy reads 31, 6 through 8. Be strong and of good courage. Fear not, nor be afraid of them. For the Lord thy God. He is it that doeth good with thee, that doeth go with thee. He will not fail thee, nor forsake thee. And Moses called unto Joshua and said unto him in the sight of all Israel, Be strong and of good courage, for thou must go with this people unto the land which the Lord has sworn unto their fathers to give them. And thou shalt cause them to inherit it. The Lord, he is it. He is, he is, is that doeth go before thee. He's not going to send us nowhere that he's not going to go. He will be with thee. He will not fail thee. Neither forsake thee. Fear not. Neither be dismayed. Let us pray, precious Father, in the name of Jesus. I thank you. I thank you for your word. I thank you for your people. Oh God, anoint us afresh to do what you will have us to do, to serve you, to serve your people. In the mighty name of Jesus. None of Shirley, none of, none of me, none, none of me, and all of you, Father. Oh God, in the name of Jesus. Release your divine wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. And we'll get out of your word what you will have us to have. Lord God, I'm going to have your way in this place today. Oh God, continue to encourage our bishop and first lady. Oh God, hallelujah, God, we thank you for it. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Ghost. We decree and we declare that it is so. In Jesus' sweet name, amen. 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 If we will leave a thought coming out of Deuteronomy 31, 6 through 8, it will be not long. Right. Bishop, not alone. I know you know by now, not alone. Here in our text today, Moses is talking to Joshua and the children of Israel. <clears throat> Moses knows that they are about to go over to the promised land. Here Moses is giving them a command from God Almighty. Yes, you are about to 
embarking to embark to something new mm -hmm. and something that you have never had that you could call your own. Mm -hmm. Moses continued, co commanded them to be strong yeah. and of good courage. Yeah. Yeah. Fear not, nor be afraid of them. Mm -hmm. For the Lord thy God, he is that do go with thee. Mm -hmm. He will not fail thee, nor forsake thee. In other words, you are not alone. Oh. You're not lonesome. Yeah. <laughs> You're not deserted by yourself. Good God of mine. Oh. You're not abandoned. Well. You're not unaided. You got your aid, which is Jesus Christ. I would say. You are not without help. You got your help. Yeah. All your help yeah. coming from the Lord. Yeah. Good Preach. God of mine. My sisters and brothers, God wants us to know that it still stands true today. Amen. Because he is still the, the same God Amen. today, yes. yesterday, yes. and forevermore. Yes. We are not alone. Mm -hmm. Whether we do good or bad, yes. God sees and he knows all things. Oh. Good God of mine. Yes. My friends, we are not alone. Yeah. God will never leave you yeah. nor forsake us. Yeah. Not, no, never. Yeah. You see, our sins will separate us from him. Okay. God truly loves us and want the very best for us. Yeah. He wants us to cast all our cares upon him yeah. because he cares for us. Remember, he made us in his own image. So don't let nobody tell you you're nobody, you're nothing. Good God of mine. You can look them dead in the square in the face that I made in the image of God. Lord, I just want to say. Like David, the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. Yeah, you will walk through the valley of the shadow of death. I will fear no evil. My friends, because, excuse me, we will have some valley days. God knows we're going to have some dark days. It is not going to be easy always. But the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. For thou art with me. Thy rod and thy staff, they come for me. Surely. Surely, goodness and mercy shall follow me all the days of my life. And I will dwell in the house of the Lord forever. My friends, we are not alone. God will never leave us. Family and friends may walk off, but not God. Good God of mine, I want us to know to stand firm and keep holding on to God's unchained hand. Because God will never, never leave us. No, not alone. He's always there with his company and arms going all around us. When things get rough, sometimes they're going to get rough. But good God of mine, I want to encourage you, Bishop, that first lady, that keep on holding on, throwing up a holy hands for the God.
know that they serve a true and living God. They want to serve idol gods, get with other people and do what they want, do what they're doing. We don't work like that. We are not alone. We are not alone. Jesus is with us always. Even to the end of the world. Moses. Jesus, Jesus. He got up there. He got he was, now that Bible tells us they know him and Aaron are laying on the floor and talk to God. But when he got up to the Israelites, yes, all that mess began to sink back down. And, and, and because it come up. He got upset all over again. See, that's why we got to continue to pray for ourselves. Before we meet the crowd, get a good prayer. Get a good prayer. A good talking to Jesus. And Jesus begin to fill our heart. We can't just go to the crowd just without no prayer, without no fasting. We got to do it. When we have it needed, we got to let it for God. We got to talk to God. Not just the pastor, but everybody that's going in these meetings. Moses and Aaron. See, it, it was both of them, the brothers, both two, the brothers. Got up before the crowd. He began to, first of all, call them out of the name. You rebels. Oh, he smoked the rock. Water gushed out. Instead of speaking to the rock, doing it God's way. Yeah. See, God give us good instructions, yeah. some divine instructions. Yeah. Yeah. And he wants us to follow by the ladder. Yeah. Sometimes people get upset with the pastor for following the instructions by the ladder. Oh, I don't believe God told me to do that. Hmm. Sometimes, no. But amen, praise God, you about to talk to God about it. You're not going there and do it your way because you think the pastor is wrong or you think the leader that's in that, that person in the other auxiliary is wrong. You talk to God. Yeah, yeah. But Moses smoked the rock. Yes. God let them get their water. <laughs> the animals got fed, got, got, got water. The children, everybody got their water. God didn't call them out right then. When they got to themselves, Jesus, Moses, Amen. Because of your disobedience, you will not go to the promised land. Moses, them eyes eyed, eyed it out. Don't send somebody over to look at it. And the Lord gave him, took him to the end so he could look. Back up, Moses, you can't go. And Moses, he was still a good man after God's own heart. He gave uh, uh, the Israelites, he gave uh, Joshua instructions. Be a good parent. I know I can't go. I messed up. See, that's what a good leader would do. They will own up to what they've done. I messed up. I was trying to get God's glory. And now God don't have that. It, now, it was a wonder. Now, it was a good thing that God didn't smack him down. They kill him because God, you don't mess with God's glory. Yes. You don't mess with God's glory. But God gave him another chance. He was still leading the, the people. He was still leaving. No, he couldn't go to that promised land. Flowing with milk and honey, he couldn't go. He couldn't go to that promised land, but he could go, he could go to, to the promised land of heaven. But he couldn't go to that promised land. He said, Joshua, you got the Lord will be there with you. you that's my well, the reason I brought Moses in about this commotion was letting them know you, you're not alone. Yeah. I messed up, but you're not alone. I'm not alone. I messed up. God forgave me. I'm not alone. You're not alone. Be of good courage. Be strong. Yeah, yeah. Bishop, we thank God for you. Continue to stand strong. Yes. Continue to lead and guide your people, your flock, and any of them in mine all. Continue to lead and guide your 20 some churches in the conference. When you go down to the general church, continue to do what you're supposed to do. By the grace of God, you're not alone. Amen. You're not alone. Sure, uh, first lady's going to stand right there by your side. I ain't going to say behind your back because the book, the Lord, the Bible said it took her out, I took you out, took her out of your reel, took you your reel. Your reels is on the 
beside, not behind you. So I know First Lady is going to stand right there with me. To God be the glory. But you are never alone. You're, you're not alone. The reason I'm saying you're not alone is you always got God on your side. Amen. amen. Praise God. And, 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 and Moses, and it, Moses said in, in the book of Numbers, he said, I praise God. He said, you will be the head and not the tail. You shall be above only. He said, only and not beneath. He said, you shall be above only and not beneath. Beneath. If you obey the word of the Lord. Amen. In the book of Deuteronomy, that was 28 chapter. Praise God. To God be the glory. To God be the glory. Paul picked it up and let us know that you are not alone. He said, I am persuaded. I am persuaded. You can't change my mind on this thing. I know what I know. I've been through what I've been through. But I was persuaded that I did nothing shall be able to separate me from the love of God. In other words, not alone. Not alone. I've been shipwrecked. I've been beat. And my friends that I thought I had, they come up against me. I've been beat. I praise God in all this type of trouble. But no alone. I'm not alone. That's why I'm persuaded. That's why you can't change my mind. Because I know what I know. I'm standing on the promises that we are not faithful. I'm standing on the promises of God. Not alone. Not alone. Not alone. To God be the glory. We are not alone. Oh, we thank God for everything He's done and said in His name. God is a good God. God is a good God. And we praise Him for what He's doing in these last and evil days. Amen. Praise the Lord. That's the word for today. Not alone. Be the glory. God be the glory.